What's up everyone, it's your favorite blind chick back on your screen with another vlog. Usually we don't start off here, but what happened was I was filming another video, so call this vidception, because over here, I'm still set up, it just shut off, and I went to turn off my mic here, and look, it died too. You know, God sometimes speaks to you and then he yells when you don't listen. The light is also coming into my unit weirdly. You can see the lines of the blinds on the floor, so if that's not a sign, I don't know what it is. I'm just gonna have to use whatever take that I had before and make it work. So if you're watching this video, hopefully that video is up and you'll know what happened. I'm going to make a super late lunch now because it's three o'clock. I haven't eaten since breakfast. I had a protein shake, which had me, I don't know what it was about the shake, but I'm like, not today. I had to have tea after and water to flush out the phlegm. I don't know if it has milk protein in there because sometimes milk does that. Oh, it could have been the kefir I had this morning. Either way, anyway, here's the update. I did yoga this morning. Something about Sundays, anytime I look up from my screen, where'd the sun go? Sun setting already. That means it's time for me to edit. I put an hour in yesterday. I gotta do another two today and then that's it. Because last week getting carried away, six hours of editing, we can't do that anymore. I need to use my time more wisely, which is why I got my agenda here. Gotta set myself up for success. Meal prep, eat dinner eventually, and then chill. Because after all, it is Sunday, right? I wanna watch a movie, but I don't know what to watch. Do you have any suggestions? The other night I watched Last Night in Miami, it was so good. And it was a perfect vibe considering it's Black History Month. I learned so much that I never knew. Ever since I watched 12 Years a Slave a couple years back, I have been traumatized. I knew slavery was horrendous, but something about that movie, I cannot with those types of movies anymore. So ever since then, every February or whenever I'm feeling like getting a little bit of a cultural fix, the types of movies I watch, the flicks I pick, have nothing to do with slavery because I, I was so upset by that film. I cannot, I literally cannot. So I don't know what I wanna watch tonight, or maybe I'll read. Last night I was reading The Art of Seduction the night before I was reading The Art of Flaneuring. What's with all these art of books? But they're both really good. I need to learn to finish a book. <laughs> There's books I've been reading since 2018. It's just that I get so tired. I just don't wanna look at the screen anymore. Maybe I should really get into audiobooks, but then I don't like people reading to me. It feels weird, like I'm five again or something. <laughs> It's Monday. I figured that I would check in with you since it's already afternoon. I was working, which is why I'm kind of late. Sorry. But I was hoping I could get a quick video in since the sun is peeking through, which is good lighting. I don't know if I will be able to because I need to head out soon for my half day in office. And I also want to stop off at the grocery store. Not for a whole shop, just a mini one. I need to get oat milk all weekend long. I kept putting oat milk in my milk frother because it wasn't frothing. Usually oat milk is really good at frothing, so I don't know if my frother's messed up. I try to use 2% milk, which I don't like to drink milk. I'll use it for baking, but to drink, ugh. And it froths, so I don't know what's going on with that. But I can't have a broken milk frother. Amazon, I'm looking at you. I only got that frother a couple months back, so it shouldn't be kaput already, okay? This has now become my weekly catchphrase. Something always happens every Monday. Look. Can you make sense of this? Why? Ta-da! I don't know why, but I feel so anxious. Who's 
boy's idea was to mop the door. First thing out of the box is, oh, it's nice and deep too. This is gonna be good for whenever I fry stir fries. It's pretty though. I have some questions, Sway. Whose idea was to make it like this? And this is from Wayfair. A couple of vlogs ago, I showed you a little one code. It didn't even work. It was inspired from last time. But that's okay, because I'm in very much in need of it. Ow, 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 my nail! Uh-oh. morning i'm really enjoying this chair a little bit too much now that it's daylight and i can see the color i'm in love with it you don't understand it took me three days to end up ordering this because i was super unsure i was like will this beige shade look good with the gray that i have going on here anything is better than that old chair in the back i have to toss out eventually but i got a lot of work to do because it's payment day and part of my role is to accept to process the payments i guess they say but anyway i'm super excited for day eight because i have no idea what i'm gonna let go of by day seven you've already let go of 28 things by the 28th day it's almost 450 things if you let go of more and more and more it's gonna get harder and harder and harder i feel like a hoarder but there's gotta be eight things i can find here that i no longer need got a lot of work got a lot of work got a lot of work Baby, that's me. Uh, I believe it was Visa. I don't know. Okay, that's all I gotta do. Now repeat it 10 more times. Oh wait, one more step. here before it gets even darker and the store closes i gotta return well not return but let me just show you this just so you know what i'm working with it's so embarrassing do you see this my tripod is jangled so we're gonna take it to the store and hopefully they can fix it i'm very very late can you see this ratchetness Woo! warranty the only thing is the store closes at six which means i need to leave Look. shouldn't be doing that recipe didn't ask for an egg so we'll skip on that i'm just gonna put some olive oil then let's make a little bit of sauce because of course it starts with soy sauce so. just see me 
speed walking to Henry's. I didn't want to be late. I got there at 5.45 and it closed at 6. I was like, this is, this is my luck. The subway was delayed, not once, but twice, and there was no streetcar in sight. So I ended up having to walk once I got off the subway. Thank God it's only about three blocks away. The way I was walking, you would have thought I was in my 60s, speed walking with Gertrude and Peggy. <laughs> Old names always kill me. There's just certain names that you wouldn't hear someone name their kid now. Ooh, it's making my eyes water. Try this frying pan out and see how it goes. One of my biggest fears is starting a fire in my face. My godmother did when I was a kid. Are you still smoking? No, all good. set the mood for myself and put on a candle since I haven't done that in a minute but look at all the struggle I had to go through to do it all of these matches and I finished this lighter just to light one candle I went back in and added twice the seasoning the recipe asked for because that was mm. enough now you know me and post-its don't get along but look at this one I zoomed in oh it's so sweet gosh I had to sit still for 10 minutes because I was so cold no Elsa I was frozen for real for real it's gonna be another busy day but quickly outfit of the day some velvet leggings one of my favorite crop sweaters it's got the scallop detailing and that's it I don't even have an access Ooh, I have earrings but that's it I forgot all my other accessories because I was in a rush the carpet guy just hit on me he's like where are you from <laughs> Sir, I have my mask on. There's nothing to hit on. I'm struggling. Ow, that hurt. Lunches served. Ooh, it looks store-bought. I used to always buy these from Village Juicery, but they're so expensive, so now I just make my own. The way I can go shower quickly and edit. I really need to get this video up. It's gonna be up in the next hour or so. I just gotta do some last minute effects just so it's up to my standard and then we'll be set. I'm gonna do some YouTube planning. I also gotta repaint my nails. Don't know if you can see. It's probably a good idea, but it's dark wouldn't want to see this anyway <laughs> it's a tragedy i mean i did do a lot of work today so i don't mind it gives me something to do tonight that's going to be a little bit of self-care and when i paint my nails my mind wanders which i kind of feel that vibe tonight i have a million one days This is the set that I showed you in the lookbook from Naked Wardrobe. I was so concerned that these leggings would not be thick enough, but they are definitely cold temp approved. Just make it a little more office appropriate for the whole two people that are coming in today. <laughs> All right, today is a bit busy one. You know, it's funny when people come in and you say good morning and they ask you how you are and you say you're good, but really you're dying inside because your course has arrived. The moment when you realize you've been going the whole day, with your tag still on. That is great. Probably so loud, sorry about that, but I gotta use, I can breathe a little bit. I gotta use my lunch very wisely. There's a million things I gotta do. I wonder if I should go to Noah's food right now. It's actually not that cold, so I should chance it. it begins the struggle of trying to find something on a little bottle like this. For aloe vera juice, where would that be? Oh, it's right here. And it's only 12 bucks. A smaller bottle to start. Is this the same thing? Yep. It's half the price as it was on Amazon. It's sad how many stores are permanently closing. It's a tricky part of card shopping. Would you? 
I came home for my cord. I came home for this because I need to wash my hands before I take it. It's just, it's too much right now. I can't believe I got all that done in less than an hour. It was a race against the clock. So happy I got everything done in less than an hour. Now the kettle is just brewing. It's tea time. I figured it might as well be since when I got back from break. Wow, that's mad loud. The, <laughs> the owner dude is in having a meeting and where the meeting room is, they keep the door open and I feel rude closing it now since I came in part way. Oh, this smells so good. When I zoomed in, it said apple cider, but it can't be that. I have a whole tin of this at home and it smells nothing like this. So scared. Oh my God, what am I doing? Sun is setting fast. Let's get this yoga practice in. was ugly in the pan but it turned out delicious 22 something light do you ever do that you just keep moving clutter from one side to another it just doesn't have a home let's make a whole pot of tea because that's exactly what i need honey jars get so messy so quick i swear i wipe it every time i use it but i guess i didn't do a good job last time because half of the shelf came off i pulled this out Luckily, they're going to be renovating this whenever I move out, so it doesn't matter. But if they weren't, I would feel so bad. How's my tea game? Ooh, she fancy, huh? Keep back in here. Big step. Big step. No, 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 no. Wait, the white ones are not supposed to be no. Uh-oh. <laughs> <sighs> I feel so much better, but still not quite myself yet, but I'm grateful that I feel better than I did this morning. I just been chugging away at work. That yoga sesh I did was not what I signed up for. I had thought it was gonna be light work, low key. Uh -huh. That ish was hard AF and very fast paced. It was a good practice, don't get me wrong. I just didn't expect that and didn't have the energy for it. So luckily I got through. By the time I realized what it was, I had just, I was like, I'm already here. I'm, let's just finish this. But I was out of breath, sweating. It was a whole mess, but it was still a lot of fun. So I don't know what else is gonna really happen today. It's gonna be a very quiet Friday. When I tell you I cannot feel my toes, oh my gosh, it's not even that cold. It's just that I had to use my entire lunch break to wait. I'm still frozen and I've been home for a minute now. I'm gonna make a, well, not make, I'm heating up my chili because I need instant warmth. I'm so happy that I was able to get the new tripod today. What they had said on Tuesday was it was back ordered at least two months. So I don't know if it's because I was waiting outside for more than 30 minutes that they just pulled one from the cut. I don't know if it was back ordered for somebody else, but I'm not complaining. I didn't even check it because it was so cold. Yup, looks good. Yay, it's not ratchet and broken anymore. It feels different. Hey, look at the smoothness. This is what happens when it's brand newness. Hey. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Good things come to those who wait in the frigid cold, eh? It feels like Christmas four years ago again when I got this. No one girl should be this happy for a tripod, but for real? God is good. I don't even have to adjust it, it's level. Tripod tribe, tripod trio. I'm actually discarding this one because it's all types of busted. <laughs> Same spot, different day, Hey, <laughs> It's Saturday, you really haven't missed much. I'm just looking for jobs. I had lunch, I did yoga, just everything's been super, super low key today. It feels more like a Sunday than anything else, but 
I'm not complaining because that means tomorrow I get another Sunday. Ah, I still can't believe this is life. Like sometimes I sit down and I'm just like, we're living through a pandemic.